In all the problems so far, we've been setting up equations with words and then solving them. We're going to try that same approach, but this time with geometry. We're going to look at angles. An angle is used to represent a certain amount of rotation. You might have heard doing a 360. If you're looking out in one direction and turn all the way around, you've gone 360 degrees. So some angle is only part of 360 degrees. We're not going to look at just any angle. We're going to look at some special angles that have unique relationships. 